summer is in full swing and temperatures are rising. So, Katie and I decided to head north to seek out milder temperatures. Idaho mountain country is covered in dense forest. Douglas firs and ponderosa pines tower above the forest floors. The ground is lush and green, covered with thousands of plants, flowers, and mushrooms. The sound of wind through the trees and rushing waters calmed the mind and relaxed the body. As always, we are on high alert for birds. It didn't take long to find one of our favorite friends, the song sparrow. Perhaps he found us. It seems like everywhere we go, there he is. Never gets old. We're continually adding new species to our life list. Katie is quite serious about that list and must be 100% sure of the species before adding it to the record. So, when this guy popped up, we started scratching our heads. What is this guy? A hermit thrush? Swainson's thrush? Maybe you guys can help us out on this one. Either way, he was a cute little fellow and gave us quite the show.
Well, look who dropped by to steal the show. One of our favorites, the Western Tanager. Our friend initially kept to the top of the trees, but as we spent more time with them, he became more and more comfortable with our presence. Such a treat to see one of these guys. We read in the Reader's Digest book of North American birds that the Western Tanager was first discovered by the Lewis and Clark expedition, somewhere in what is now called Idaho. Coincidentally, Idaho was the first place Katie and I discovered the Western Tanager as well. Right here on this very spot, three years ago, amongst the Douglas firs and Ponderosa pines.